with forward pay from Appalachian Wireless, you'll avoid contracts and credit checks while taking advantage of some awesome perks, like unlimited talk, text, and three gigs of data for just $44.99, or with five gigs for a mere $59.99. Forward pay. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. 50-year-old Michael Lowe was found dead by family members Tuesday afternoon in his apartment at the Mountain Breeze Apartments at Burdine near Jenkins. Little information has been released about Lowe's death. The initial investigation began as a death investigation led by Kentucky State Police who were at the scene serving an unrelated warrant when Lowe was found. Uh, the family has been notified. Um, at this time it is a, K- it is a KSP-led investigation uh, and it is a death investigation. That's all the information that we can give at this time, however. Our condolences do go to the family, though. The following day, however, Letcher County Coroner Perry Fowler said injuries Lowe had suffered were consistent with foul play. Fowler did not give any details on the injuries or what may have caused them. Social media was abuzz Tuesday evening and Wednesday, however, with rumors of a murderer on the loose in Jenkins. Jenkins Police Chief Jim Stevens acknowledged those rumors, and he said he wanted to assure the public that whatever or whomever may have caused Lowe's death was likely part of an isolated incident. Everything still is being investigated, uh, but at this time we've got no evidence showing that it was nothing other than an isolated incident. The rumors that there's somebody out there going around doing this is is farthest from the truth. Uh, At this time there's no evidence that this was nothing more than just, just one incident at this particular location. Stevens said that while the community is safe despite Lowe's death, persons in any community should be aware of their surroundings. It's as safe a situation as can be right now, uh, anywhere in in our city or our county for that matter, Uh, but you just have to be careful no matter who you're dealing with because this kind of thing can happen. It's not very often, but by being aware of what's going on around you, that'll help out too. Uh, So uh, we're not saying that there's not danger out there because obviously things happen. Uh, but in this instance, this seems to be a, very isolated, and people should feel feel like uh, fairly safe and secure in, in their own homes especially. No arrests have been made, and no charges have been filed yet in Lowe's death. Reporting in Jenkins for EKB News, I'm Chris Anderson.